All right, thanks so much, Alex. Joining us now is the man of the hour, Circa owner, Derek Stevens. Derek, thank you for being with us. We have to start out. How did you do it? You opened a casino during an international pandemic. What has that been like? Well, you know, this was a five-year project, and, uh, you know, I'm, I'm just happy about some of the attractions here. I mean, I know we just showed Legacy Club, and, you know, we just showed a picture of the world's largest sports book here at Circa. Incredible. And, um, you know, on a night like this, with this backdrop, Stadium Swim, one of our big attractions, yeah. uh, I'm just glad we're able to do something on a night like this to be able to help help out with Super Bowl of Kerry. Um, this venue is spectacular, and I'm glad we were able to uh, pitch it in here for tonight to kick in, kick in 2021. Sir is fantastic. Might need to jump in the pool where it's 90 degrees. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, Derek, this is the first mega resort to open in downtown in decades. Why did you choose this location? Well, you know, I got uh, I got into the casino business in 2006, and I bought the Golden Gate right across the street, and then bought Fitzgerald's and turned that into the D Las Vegas. And uh, I've always loved Las Vegas, and I really loved downtown. So it was uh, the next opportunity that came up, came about right in this location. This is where the Vegas Club used to be. We demolished it, but it's a, it was a five-year project. So, you know, being able to open in October, I was I was excited about it. Um, clearly, we weren't planning on a pandemic when we opened, but uh, it was probably more meaningful knowing that we were able to bring 1,500 new jobs to Las Vegas in a, in a time when this city really needed jobs. So um, it probably became even more meaningful. So for us, obviously, we were excited, but bringing the jobs in at this time was terrific. That's a great point. Half a decade of work in 1,500 new jobs. We're going to feature today tonight some of the great parts and aspects of Circa. I'm curious, what is your favorite part? I'm still trying to learn here. I, I can tell you, on, on Sundays, I'm loving the sports book. You know, I'm going to be here in the pool tomorrow uh, watching some college football, so I've been a little bit all over the place. I can't wait to watch a couple ball games there. Well, great job. Uh, Las Vegas applauds you, and uh, we're really grateful to be here tonight. It's yes. been a blast. Thank, Thank you, you very so much. much. Thank, you. Thank you. Again, this is all for a good cause tonight. We do want you you to do your part to help. We are raising money to help feed people in your city. So make sure to call, text, or scan the QR code on your screen. Let's go now to Maria, who's down at the big board with an update. You know, and let's talk about that beautiful backdrop that we have behind us. Lots of you sharing your photos with us using the hashtag VegasNYE. Here are just a few that you can see right now. They're out of Los Angeles. A lot of people doing that. They're tweeting us, Instagramming us, Facebooking us. We want to see what you're doing this New Year's Eve. Keep sending those photos and here's what we have coming up a lot more planned stay tuned las vegas countdown to 2021 continues we're getting ready to say goodbye to 2020 vegas style as we take you to the very top of the plaza for an exclusive look at the fireworks coming up on the countdown to 2021 